Hi, welcome back to Ras Aquaculture Channel. Previously in part 2, we tested new salt for mud crab farming. However, the crab die on the third day due to high ammonia levels. Now, let's see what we changed and whether the new setup was successful. After reviewing our setup, we found the real problem the aeration system was not turned on. Without aeration, oxygen levels dropped, and ammonia built up, leading to poor water quality. To fix this, we cleaned the tank and started fresh. This time, we added 60 liters of water and 0.586 kilograms of salt without sodium bicarbonate. After setting up the new system, we tested the water quality. The salinity was at 10 ppt, within a safe range for mud crabs. The alkalinity measured for 50 ppm. And most importantly, ammonia was 0 mg L, meaning the water was clean and stable. This was a big improvement from our last test, where high ammonia led to crab mortality. With better conditions, we were hopeful that the crabs would thrive in this setup. 2,000 years later. After one week, the crab is still alive, eating well, and showing no signs of stress. The new setup with proper aeration seems to be working. With good aeration, clean water, and controlled parameters, this test shows that the new salt can support mud crab farming. Please give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.